Hey guys, I'm back with the last video in my What's in My Bag Purse Organization mini series here. I'm showing you guys an updated look at what's in my purse as well as how I keep those things organized. And the first video was how I um, organized in my tote size bag, which you can I'll of course link these videos below if you missed them. The second video was how I organize my medium size bag which is usually like a cross shoulder, a cross body kind of bag. And then this video is going to be showcasing how I organize my, the contents of my evening bags and what I carry around in my evening bags with me. So this is a great little bag I've had for a few years now from Kate Spade. And I actually think they still carry it because I think I saw it in a department store not too long ago. But if I can find it, I'll link it below. Um, this is a great bag. First of all, it's cute as anything. It goes with so many different things and is a really nice size. I'm not the kind of person who can carry around those like teensy tiny little nothing bags. Once in a while I do carry around just like a wristlet or something but that is not ordinary. I usually carry something like this or similarly sized that can house or hold as many things as this does. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what I've got in here and basically you'll see there's a theme if you've watched all these videos um, this bag is so cute. I just have to show you on the zipper pull. It says "Have Courage." Very cute. Um, is how is it just like a mini version of what I keep in my other bags? So I'm gonna try to give you the best look I can. It's getting harder and harder because it's smaller and smaller space. So you can kind of see right away, of course, that I have things in cases. Now there's only one case in this bag because it's a tiny little bag. Then I have a wallet, and then I'm utilizing some of the bags features like slip pockets and the zip pocket in the back. So this bag does have a zip pocket as you can see as well as a sl uh, slip pocket in the front and then it's actually pretty roomy for this size sort of evening bag in the middle. So what do I take with me when I'm at a party or a wedding or an event or out to dinner or something like that? Well here you'll find out. I have this little wallet. This is the best little wallet ever. This is a little wallet from Coach that I got probably about five or six years ago. I love this wallet. I don't know if they still carry this kind of wallet. You guys will have to let me know if they do. This is such a great small purse um, clutch size wallet. It is flat and tiny, but it's like sort of structured like a normal wallet with a place for an ID and you can fit cards in here and um, of course a place for money. So this is a great little wallet. I use this every time I carry a small bag. And I often will travel with this wallet as well. Of course I have my phone in there. And then I have a tiny, tiny walking pharmacy. So um, I think I'm going to save this to show in the other walking pharmacy video that I'm going to post showcasing all of my walk walking pharmacies. But this basically is just even smaller version of, you know, my main walking pharmacy, if you guys watched the first video, is this size. And then there's this tiny little guy, and this is a little, actually a little coin purse, I believe, from Vera Bradley that I've had for quite a while. If they still sell something like this, I'll post a link to it below, I'm not sure. But it's just got real basics in it. This is just basics that I would need for a party or dinner out sort of situation. Um, so not nearly as many things as would be in like an all day sort of situation in my normal handbag. So I have that and that just keeps everything really nice and corralled and together and it fits so nicely in this little case. Um, and depending, I have some um, evening bags that are smaller than this and I will sometimes just take a couple things out of this, especially if I'm wearing my hair up and I don't need the hairbrush or whatever and this can get smaller and fit into a smaller size bag. Then I have a couple more loose things in this sort of bag because it's such a small bag that having a few loose things, you're not going to... Having a few loose things in this side, size bag isn't the end of the world because it's such a small bag. You can't have that much crammed in here and it's easy to find things don't get lost like in a jumbled mess. So for evening, obviously, I have like makeup y related things because I don't have room for an entirely separate little makeup bag. It's not really necessary because I only carry a couple makeup items with me when I'm out. First of which is the powder. This is by Guerlain. It's just a little pressed powder. And this is really nice actually because it's really, really light. Really, really light. Um, so there's that. And then I always have this little mirror with me. This was actually a gift from Don. 
um, from Disney World. But um, it's more sentimental value. I mean, this has a mirror in it, and so does my little brush thing. But I just like pulling this out. You know, it just seems fancier. I like a fancy thing if you want to check your makeup or whatever. Um, and it's just my little princess mirror. So I usually have that with me. And then I always carry whatever lip products that I'm wearing. So today I'm wearing a couple of products that were in um, my My Glam and Birchbox subscriptions from this month. Um, so I have this dual-sided lipstick from Laura Geller, which is like the coolest concept ever. And then this little lip gloss. And I usually, you know, will just put those in loose because like I said, they kind of stay up on their own. I also have a little roll of mints. I don't usually carry gum with me to dinner or to events, but having a little mint is nice. Those are by Newman's Organic. And then in the zip pocket, all I have are my keys. Now, if it's that time of the month, I'll slip some feminine products in the slip pocket as well, but I don't feel the need to carry them around with me all of the time. And that is how everything that I have in this little bag. But you can see it's actually quite a bit of stuff. So we've got the keys, and we've got the mirror, and my lip products, and my mints. So you can see I have those organized. You can you see? in that side slip pocket there. They fit nicely. And the keys went in the zip pocket in the back, secure item. And then I have my wallet and my phone, which we'll put in one side. My tiny walking pharmacy <laughs> goes in there. And my face powder. And those, uh, those four items, I just nestle up, you can see, kind of next to each other. And they just fit really well. And Zip closed, no problem. And I have everything that I need. It's really, really light. Um, and I'm ready to go. So I hope you guys enjoyed my little What's in My Bag purse organization mini series. If you're curious to see what I'm carrying around with me lately in my walking pharmacies, all three of them, I think I'll probably post that as one video. That just makes sense. Um, that will be the next video, so stay tuned. I hope you guys enjoyed this and that you're having a lovely day. And again, if you would like to share you know, what you carry with you in your evening bag or medium-sized bag or large tote-sized bag um, and how you keep it organized, I'd love to know, so please leave comments below. And um, yeah, I'll see you real soon. Take care, you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.